Our lesson for today is Introduction to Set. Now, in this lesson, we are going to discuss the following. Definition of set, identifying sets, and naming sets. Now, what is a set? Set is a collection of well-defined things that are related to one another or has common characteristics. Now, what do you mean by the word well-defined? Well-defined means it's clearly described or has clear common characteristics. Okay, in Filipino, ang set ay koleksyon ng mga bagay-bagay na madaling i-identify ang pagkakatulad o pagkakahawig. Okay, so that is a set. It is a collection. And it's not just a collection of things, but it is also well-defined. When we say well-defined, you can easily identify the common characteristics of those things. Okay, ano ba yung pagkakatulad ng mga bagay-bagay na yon sa isang grupo? So, that is a set. Now, we have here a collection of things. And the objects are house, bag, trees, ball, sea, mountain, bird, umbrella. Now, this is a collection of things. However, it is not a set. Okay? This collection is not a set. Why? Because the collection is not well defined. Or the common characteristics is not quite obvious. Okay, so this is a collection. Collection nga ito ng mga bagay-bagay. Bahay, uh, bag, trees, ball, sea, mountain, bird, and umbrella. However, even though it's a collection of things, but we cannot easily identify ano yung common characteristics nila. Anong, anong collection ng mga bagay-bagay? Itong collection na ito. We cannot identify. So, it is not a set. Even though it is a collection of things. Now, always remember the following for sets. So, first, it must be a collection. Second, it must be well-defined. Okay, or it's related to one another or has common characteristics. Now, let's have here uh, another set of objects or collection of objects, I should say. We have car, tricycle, bicycle, motorcycle, and truck. Now, can you identify what uh, collection of things is this? Okay, ano yung pagkakatulad ng mga bagay na ito? Okay, so this is a collection of vehicles, right? Or means of transportation. So it is a collection and at the same time, it's well defined. So we can see the common characteristics. So this is therefore a set. Okay, let's have the other group of things. We have bag, pencil, eraser, notebook, and crayons. Now this is another collection. Now, what collection of things are this? Okay, it is a collection of school supplies. So, it is a collection and uh, have you identified the common characteristics? Yes, right? So, anong pagkakatulad ng mga bagay-bagay na ito? So, lahat sila related sa mga gamit sa eskwelahan. So, since we have identified the relationship or the common characteristics of these things, this collection of objects, therefore, we can say that it is a set. Okay? Let's have the third uh, group of objects or collection of objects. We have the spoon, fork, plate, knife, casserole, pan, and glass. Now, it is a collection and can you identify what collection of objects or things? are this okay you are correct it is a collection of kitchen utensils so since it is a collection and well defined we can say therefore that this is a set so that's how to identify whether a collection is a set or not so kung kaya mo identify ano yung pagkakatulad nila sa isa't isa or meron ba silang relationship sa isa't isa at clear or madaling i-identify, then that collection of objects or group of objects is 
a set. Okay, let's have more examples. Determine whether the following collection is a set or not. We have the first group of objects, house, carpenter, shoes, woman, vegetables, bag, mango. Okay, is it a set or not? Can you easily identify the common characteristics? Anong grupo ng mga bagay itong mga nabanggit? Is it a set or not? If you can identify the common characteristics or if you can name the set, then that is actually a set. So, number one is not a set. Why? Because it is not well defined. Okay, let's go to the second example. We have banana, mango, avocado, grapes, and orange. Now, is it a set or not? Okay, you are correct. It is a set. Why? Because it is well-defined. Now, kindly name the set. Okay, so this is a set of fruits. So, okay, so ito yung banana, mango, avocado, grapes, and orange. Ito yung grupo, di ba, ng mga prutas. So, it's set of fruits. Next, we have pillow, milk, pencil, cell phone, and comb. Is it a set or not? Can you identify the common characteristics? Anong, pag, anong relationship ng mga bagay na ito? If you can identify, then it is a set. If you can't identify, pag walang relationship sa isa't isa, then it is not a set. So the answer is it's not a set because it is not well defined. Now let's have number four. We have a pink, red, blue, brown, yellow, purple, and green. Are these things related to one another? Yes or no? Is it a set or not? All right, the answer, it is a set because it is well defined. Now, will you name the set? So, the answer, it is a set of colors. Next, let's have the fifth example. The objects are eggplant, squash, string beans, and potato. Meron ba silang common characteristics or meron ba silang relationship sa isa't isa? What is the answer? Yes. Now, is it a set? Yes. So, what set is this? Will you name the set? It is a set of vegetables. Correct. Okay, let's have the last example. We have car, shoes, pencil, cake, cell phone, and tomato. Is it a set or not? Alright. It's not a set because it's not well defined. Great job! You have already mastered identifying if a collection is a set or not. Now, let's try on your own this time. Okay, you determine whether the following collection is a set or not. The objects are umbrella, money, apple, pencil, bus. The answer is correct. It's not a set. Okay, let's have practice problem number two. Shoes, slippers, socks, boots, sandals. Is it a set or not? It's a set, correct? Now, will you name the set? Okay, it is the set of footwear. Let's have practice problem 3. The objects are church, woman, book, car, television. Is it a set or not? Let's see. It is not a set because... It is not well defined. Let's have practice problem 4. We have Jollibee, McDonald's, Chow King, Mang Inasal, and KFC. Do these things have relationship with one another? Yes. So, it is a set. Now, will you name the set? The answer is, it's a set of fast food chains. Okay, let's have now a recap of our lesson. A set is a collection of def well-defined objects. Okay, take note of this. A set is a collection and at the same time, it must be well-defined. Okay, or you can easily identify the relationship of the objects or 
the common characteristics of the given objects. Now, a collection of things is not a set if it's not well defined or if the common characteristics cannot be identified. So that's all for our lesson 4 set. <music>